Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're doing the best five tweaks of the week. We do these each Sunday in collaboration with ModMy.com. Be sure and go over and check those guys out. They do an awesome job keeping us up to date on everything going on in the iOS world. So, the first one we're going to look at here is called Woo's It. Now, I haven't got this. Uh, I'm not showing you this, actually, as results on my phone because it will be too personal. So I'm just going to use the results that they have shared with us on the actual tweak. So it's 99 cents in Big Boss. And what this does, guys, it works in conjunction with True Caller app. So you will actually have to install that as well. And once you have those installed, what it does is... Anytime you get a phone call, it will search the name or the number of whoever it is is calling you and tell you all that information on the screen. This way you won't have any more unknown calls. This does a very good job searching through all the different locations. It gives you uh, where the person is actually located, such as the state and the actual country that you see there is the United States and they also you know you can actually share this if you wanted to uh, on uh, social media that would be left up to you but as you can see here it does have your location and you can even decide if you wanted to mute that that would be up to you but you can see here what it's going to look like in your uh, call list it'll have the name of the person or it will have the phone number one uh, depending on what it can find so that's called Woos it the next one we're going to be talking about here guys is uh, free as well and it's called Twitter plus plus now let's go back here where we need to be Twitter plus plus adds many many new features to the actual iOS Twitter app so if you've been using something like TweetBot, you've probably already encountered some of these features, but not inside of the iOS Twitter application. Now, to set this up, you need to go to your profile. <clears throat> Once you get here, tap the little cog, and you get a pop-up. You need to tap Twitter Plus Plus Settings. And here you can actually go through and choose whatever it is you want to enable or disable. You can open your uh, videos up in YouTube. Or you can use the built-in Twitter player they have installed in the actual app. Same thing with Instagram. You can open your links up. Uh, in Instagram or you can display media in the app itself that's going to be up to you long tweets you can uh, use default tw the Twitter default or send them as a as an image you can choose to confirm favorites which I don't do that uh, you can show the keyboard whenever you're composing a message or, or something instead of the media picker hide the follow button in the tweet uh, which I don't you know recommend if you want people to follow you you do that but that's up to you and you can choose whether or not you want to enable it to view Twitter in full screen mode by removing the uh, status bar so as you can see by it says by enabling this feature it requires restarting so I'm just going to tap cancel and we'll hit done and that's pretty much the gist of Twitter plus plus and it is free Another free one we have here today is called Swipe for More. Now, this works much like Twitter or TweetBot, but it's for Cydia. And what this one does, if you go into your installed section here, you'll see what it is I'm talking about. And Share Tweak, you see here, if I wanted to, I can swipe left. Now, I can choose whether to reinstall, remove, or cue it to be removed removed later on it adds this little cool swipe feature to your tweaks which is pretty nice and much easier to do than using the little arrow and the reinstall button and all that but that's called swipe for more uh, the next one we're looking at here is called murmur this is a new city of tweak in the big boss repo for 399 
and it is an awesome tweet, guys. If you enjoy multitasking on your iOS device, this is going to put multitasking in the palm of your hand much, much easier and better. So let me give you a little bit of a run through of what it is I'm going. It will do. So if we want to, we open up TweakBot. You see, then all I have to do is swipe from the left, and you see it minimizes. It don't minimize. It shrinks that to a smaller screen size where I can drag it anywhere I want it on my screen. And then if I wanted to say open up something else on my particular device. So all I would have to do is just type in a new web address if we wanted to go to something like iPhoneCaptain.com and then I do the same thing with it. And what makes these so brilliant, guys, is you can still interact with these. As you can see, I'm able to scroll. Uh, I can even open up uh, any new post I may want to read or anything like that. As you can see, I just chose this post here and it, and it opened it up. For me, I could read that, and then if I wanted to go back over here to uh, TweetBot, then all I would have to do is just come over here, and you can see I can still scroll and interact with it. On the iPhone, it is just a little bit finicky, but it does work pretty good uh, considering, but as you can see, you can also... T double tap the status bar here and the it gets this little pop-up you can add another screen with a plus i'm sorry increase the size of the screen with a plus sign decrease it or close it so let's look at bat evader bat evader is a dollar 49 in big boss repo and bat evader is is pretty awesome i have to say so it gives you a way to disable certain things when your battery level reaches a certain percentage like if you're almost out of power you can choose to turn off bluetooth uh, wi-fi anything that's going to drain your battery faster you can automatically adjust to turn off or turn off auto brightness and adjust to your brightness to be very very low and you set all this up under your profile configuration and you see here I've got my battery percentage set for all this to occur when my battery level reaches 20% and then I've gone in here and set up all the different conditions that I wanted it to do and here's my power saving section uh, if you wanted to even turn on the airplane mode you could do that but you see Wi-Fi I could choose to disable that when my uh, power gets 20 percent location services same thing we don't really need that bluetooth we can turn that off uh even mobile data mobile data rate personal hotspot disable and all this stuff down through here really you could just turn all that off and here's the auto brightness i was telling you about and you can even set the custom brightness to be whatever level you want it to be same thing with your power options and you, you can choose to shut down reboot or respring which i don't know why you would want to do that but that's something that will be left up to you here you can turn off all your sounds and vibrations uh your user notifications you can set those to be whatever you wanted them to be you know if you didn't want to receive those when your uh battery level got to a certain uh, percentage then you could disable all those but this is a very cool app or tweak to help save battery power it's called bat evader and uh like i said it's a dollar 49 in big boss so pretty cool pretty cool pretty cool and that's pretty much the gist of it guys hope you enjoyed them that's five for the week hit that subscribe button and keep coming back.